Hey everyone, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel, Relax Cut Glue. If you're new here, welcome. I am so happy to have you all here with me today. So yesterday I made a strawberry master board and then I created this little book with it. Um, off camera, I bound it with my cinch. I do have a video where I show how to use a cinch machine. If you want to find that, you can find it in a playlist. Um, I just made a cover here and then I have all these little four by four, uh, little bits and bobs to play in. There's the back. So I found this little piece of ephemera that I've had and I thought I would like it on here, but I don't. So I don't think I'll put that there. Yesterday I cut out a ton of images from different cut and collage books. I have some from Porto, some from Raven Rains, some from... Keely O'Brien, um, just all different. I just went through a bunch of different um, cut and collage books and just grabbed whatever I could. Some are strawberry related, some are just fruit related. I put animals, I have people, um, all kinds of stuff. So let's just start playing. All right, page one. And I don't have to always start on page one, but I think I will for this one. Let's just kind of play around and see what we like. I have this. I thought this little giraffe would be like really cute. Actually, you know what? I kind of I kind of like that. That's really cute too. I have this little kitten. Oh, the kitten looks adorable too though. I might have to go with the kitten. Okay, we're going with that. Love it. Should I go around the edges of the cat or no? I kind of feel like I need to go around the edges. I'm just going to lightly go in brown uh, just to kind of frame out my, my images here and it will make them look a little bit better. I'm not really inking it per se. I'm really just getting that white edge from when we cut the paper. Oh, there's my neighbor walking her dogs. We have this uh, couple that lives actually in an, in the house that one of my son's friends used to live in right down the street from us. And they walk these, I think they're German shepherds, if I'm remembering correctly. And one of them was really old, you could tell. And I haven't seen them walking lately and I, I kind of look out for them. But yesterday while I was in here fussy cutting, I saw the husband walk by and they had a little puppy. So I had figured that the older one, they had two of them. I had figured that the older one had passed away because I haven't seen them much. Um, and then when I saw um, him walking the little puppy, it kind of confirmed it for me. And I just was kind of, I was so happy. I wanted to run out there and be like, oh, let me meet your puppy. <laughs> but I felt like they would think I was weird. Although they have stopped and talked to my husband outside and stuff because it's a husband and wife. Uh, they just live right around the corner from us, down the street actually a little bit, but yeah. So anyways, that was really cute. It's, you know, Bob meets all kinds of people out here while he's outside doing yard work and I meet him while I'm out walking Xena. So, okay, that is adorable. So I wasn't going to add a bunch of words, but I love adding the positive sentiments to my craft project. So what am I doing here? What am I doing? trying to grab my words. So I have these little colorful words here I could add. Let's find the pink ones. Let's find the bright pink ones. Well, actually here, let's go like, let's pick one of these. Um, ooh, maybe I should do a baby blue. Maybe I should do that to kind of pop out some of that blue. How about this? Where to go? You make my heart smile. I like that. Let's just put that right across there. Boop. It's not the same blue, but close enough. Okay. That's adorable. Love it. I'm not going to um, collage on the back side. I just don't really want to. Okay. So I have this cute little hat. I thought that would be cute. What if like this little giraffe was sitting with the hat? No, that's not the right page for that. I do have the little toucan. Mm, put him like that and then maybe something right in there. I do have, let's see, 
Oh, I have a little cupcake. I want to do that like he's eating the cupcake. I don't really like that. Um, does he want a macaron? I actually do like this, but I just had one on this page. That's what we just put there. So is that weird? I do like the way that looks though. You know what? I'm going for it. Who cares? Who cares? Okay. Let's just lightly hit this edge here. It just really helps get this, this white line right here. Um, it makes it go away and it just makes the images look better on the paper. In my opinion, you don't have to do this if you don't want to. It just makes the images look more polished when you add just a little bit of ink on the edges. And then, of course, if you want it to look inked, then you, you know, really go to town there. But I'm just really trying to get those little edges. Don't want to cut off his little toesies there, his little toenails, since I worked so hard to make sure they stayed on there. I'm just going to bend this a little so I can get inside here. There we go. Okay. So how did I have it? I had it like this and then kind of overlapping a little. Oh, that's so cute. And I love the green with like, it matches perfect. That's why I picked this little one. Okay. So I need to glue this down, but not the stem all the way. Cut or stem, tree branch, whatever it is. Oh gosh, I hope I don't rip it. Okay, so I had him about here, right? And then I had that like that. I think I had him moved over just a little. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's not ruin it. Okay. Now let's glue this. Ooh, this is so fun. So fun. Okay. There we go. Boop, boop. Actually, I want to bring this up just, just a wee bit there. Okay, let's press this down now. That is adorable. I love that. I wanted to show you really quick before I go on here. Hold on. If you don't have a cinch machine, you can use these. You get them at the Dollar Tree or you can get them in any office supply section of a store and just punch some holes and add these little rings to it and then you could have a little book as well. Okay, love that. Definitely want to add something, but I want to go with something green. These aren't really lime green, but let's see what else I have here. Oh, here's some bright greens. Let's grab one of these. I like this one. Creativity takes courage. And I agree, it does take courage, especially if you're gonna be putting your creativity online. That's adorable. Oh my gosh, this is so fun, so simple, so easy. I just want to put one or two little elements because I don't want to take away from my paper. So I just want a few little things to, um, you know, accentuate the page. Oh, that's so cute. So cute. Okay, now let's do this one. So I love her. She looks really good right here. What else could I put with her? I have a cupcake. No, because that takes away the entire strawberry section there. Yeah, I don't want to take away the strawberry section. I have a smaller cupcake. I could do something like maybe put her, her here. Maybe this little cupcake coming out. No, I don't like that. Ooh, what about this? What if I just put this? Like that. Hmm. Maybe she's not the right one for this page. I could put that. Where'd that little giraffe go? Let's try that. Yes? No? I don't know. I have a little pug, a pug here. Could put some of these like that, maybe. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I do have some birds too, so 
I do have this one. That's not bad either. I do like that, but I just had a bird on the last page. I do have this big hat. Ooh, I kind of like that hat. Oh, I kind of like that. I think I might go with that. Maybe I should move the hat over just a smidge so I can move my giraffe over a hair. Yeah, I think I'll go with that. I really do. Okay. All right, let me just go around the edges with whatever residual ink I have here. Sometimes it's so fun to just work on something smaller where you only add one or two little elements, maybe three, um, because it just, I don't know, it's a simple collage, but it's so fun. And I think that even the simple ones leave a big impact. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but I like small projects. I like little things. I don't know. When I was uh, doing a lot of um, collage books back in the day, I made things like this all the time. This was like my favorite thing to do. Okay, let's put the hat like that. And then this cute little feller right there. Yep, okay, I'll go around him just a little bit. I really love putting, um, you know, a lot of these cut and collage books have food items and I never really know what to use with them. So I just started putting all my little animal images from cut and collage books with the food and I love the way they look. I think it's super cute, really whimsical and fun. So if you don't know what to do with your food, add some animals with them. I think it just looks really cute. Okay, here we go. Let's give this a press. And I'll trim this. I left the little giraffe legs a little bit long so that I could trim them off if I needed to. There we go. Oops, did I get it? Yeah. Okay, that's too cute. Too cute. Um, do I want to add a word? Don't I have some little I have some little butterflies too? Do I like the butterfly here? I do like the butterfly there. But I also liked it over here. Or is that just too much? Shoot. I don't know. Where's my other butterfly? I have another one. Where is it? Little butterfly, where are you? Oh, there it is. It's green, though. So that actually looks good there, too. Don't like it so much there. I kind of like it. Let's just do it. Let's just glue it down. Why not? We'll add all the things on this page. Okay. So got our little butterfly. I might add just a little word like this one. Cultivate kindness. So we'll just put this one up here. And I brought it down just a smidge. Yeah, that works. Okay, cultivate kindness. And then I kind of wanted something down here. I don't have to, but I kind of wanna. I wanna wanna. Um, nope, I'm just gonna leave it. I am going to leave it, I know. Okay, next. So fun. Okay, next page. Ooh, this is fun. Okay, I have this cute little thing here and I could just put I mean simple as that right I also have this one could put right there oh I do like that what else do I have oh yeah I cut out some of these So cute. Could put like a little, a 
little strawberry right there with the bunny. Could do that. Should I do something like that? I don't know. That is really cute though. What else? I also have Maybe put her down here. Just like that. And then something to that effect. Or I could even just, you know. Hmm. Do I like it? Do I like it a lot? I don't know. And then I have this little pug too. This pug would be really cute. Um, what about this and the pug? Hmm, not bad. I do have these too. That's cute. Could do the flowers and what about her? Might need to go this way. No, no, nope, she won't work for that one. Where's the, could do that. That's not bad. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. I don't know. They all look cute together. It's all about just being, I don't know, I guess picky and <laughs> picky which one you want. Oh man, let's glue this. I got up to warm up my coffee and I came back in here and I had a little visitor. Little Miss Zini Beanie's in here with me. Sherman's still asleep on the couch. Let's see how long it takes before he realizes we're both gone. Then he'll come in here. So far, he hasn't noticed. Okay, let's move this over a little bit. Like that. And we'll put this like that. Yep, okay, it's happening. Love it, love it. Big old truck. Okay. Oops. There we go. Perfect. 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 Do I want to add a little strawberry right here? Maybe. Just for, I don't know, something. <laughs> yeah, let's just add it. Why not? I mean, come on. Two to three items. That's my max. Plus some words, obviously. They don't count. All right, we'll just add a little strawberry right here too. Why not? Why not? Okay, I need a word because I'm addicted to the words. How about collect beautiful moments? I like it. I like it. And that works. There we go. Super cute. Do I want to add this? I'd be breaking my rule a little bit. Now it's too much. Okay. I mean, it looked, well, shoot. Now that looked really good though. No. Okay. All right. Next piece. What else? I do have this bird. I don't think this is the page for the bird. What about? No. Oh. 
or let's try her with this one. You know, I think I kind of like her better with this one. Okay, let's do that. Let's glue her down. And how did I have this again? Let's just put this down. I think I had it about like this. Pretty sure. Yeah, okay. There we go. And we'll do this. I wanna go around her hair. And her shirt, make it pop. You guys, on Friday, it was 62 degrees and I got sunburned. <laughs> I only laugh because it's ridiculous. 62 degrees and I get sunburned, I'm telling you. It's crazy. Uh, I didn't get burned too bad, but I get heat stroke really easily, so I always have to be really careful. Um, but I had a headache all day. Uh, well, Friday night I started getting it and then all day Saturday and a little bit on Sunday. Or wait, maybe I got burnt on Saturday. I don't remember. Either way, I got burnt at some point on my face and stuff. And um, yeah, I got a headache from it. So I have to be careful ridiculous. I just thought I wanted to get out there and get some vitamin D, but apparently the universe is against me. <laughs> just kidding. Okay. Um, I don't think I'm going to add anything else. I don't even know if I'll add, maybe I will add something. Um, how about attitude is everything. Attitude is everything and then see possibilities everywhere follow your heart let's do that follow your heart oops i'm going to use a straight line of this paper right here and hope that it's straight with my page it's not really but that's okay all right that is cute oh my gosh this is so fun i'm obsessed obsessed Okay, this is fun for me. I love little projects like this. Okay, um, let's see, what else, what else? Okay, I do have this little tea situation here. I mean, I could always just like, that doesn't look bad. That doesn't look bad. Let's add it, why not? Let's just do it. Let's go around just a little bit here. Again, just defining my edge, not really inking per se oh my gosh so the other day when my mom and sister and I were shopping for my we were when we were hanging out for my mom's birthday so we were at the store and my sister was showing me some watercolors she just found and I was telling her this technique that she could do or they were watercolor pens because I don't if you're in my Facebook group you'll see my sister is in there and she's been doing um, a lot of watercolor especially since um, the passing of our father it's just really helped her and it's kind of her her creative outlet of something to do you know she's a mom of young kids so she needs something for herself anyways I digress so I'm sitting here and I'm telling her about this and we're just kind of talking quietly in our own little bubble and this lady comes out of nowhere and she goes, oh, did you know if you do it like this, blah, 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 blah. And my sister is really nice. She's like, oh, okay, thank you. And then she's like, because I know because I'm a junk journaler. I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and I wanted, I should have said like, oh, who do you follow on YouTube? <laughs> I'm just curious. Um, but it was really, she's like, I know, cause I'm a junk journaler. I didn't say anything. I didn't say like, I'm a YouTuber or anything like I just, and my sister's like, I was wondering if you were going to say something. And I was like, no, you know, whatever. Um, she wasn't mean or anything. She was a super nice lady. Uh, but I saw it was funny. She's like, I know, cause I'm a junk journaler. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Um, maybe oh, if it wasn't green, I would add a butterfly right here. Did I use, I did use that other butterfly, didn't I? Is there another little one in here? I want a little one right there. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to go look for a butterfly. Actually, 
in here, I was looking, so, so these were gifted to me. They're amazing um, sticker books, by the way, but there was a strawberry in here, but there was also, oh, there's a little butterfly. That might be too little. So here's the strawberry. I kept it out in case I wanted to use those stickers in here, which I definitely will. Um, I just want to see if I wanted to use a butterfly sticker. There's bees. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to go grab a butterfly and then I'll be right with you. Okay. Oh, I hear the Shermanator. So I was thinking about maybe just adding this little butterfly right here. Now that one seems a little big. I thought it would be like the perfect size, but oh, should I just put it like right here? Like that? Here he comes. Or like that. Oh no, now I don't know. Hi Sherman. Did you find us? Yeah. I actually kind of like it right here. I'm just going to add it right there. I like it. Okay. All right. I need to bring in the other bed now that there's two of you in here. That way one of you doesn't have to sleep on the floor. Of course, you are a dog. You probably don't mind. Okay. I do want to add something up here. Just something little. How about everything has beauty? That's cute. Everything has beauty. We'll put it right in between these green spots right here. All right, everything has beauty. That is so cute. Okay, I could go on for days and probably just finish this, um, but let's go through really quick. Actually, I'm gonna clean up real fast here. Okay, so let's go through and look at all the pages that we created today. We have this cute little one. Look how fun this is. This is so fun. I should make some of these and give them out. Not like decorate it, but like an undecorated one so you could decorate your own. I mean, you could also make your own, but I don't know. Might be kind of fun. Oh, I love her. That is so cute. And I love her with like this lacy um, strawberry there. It just looks, she looks really cute here. I like that. I really like this one too. That's really cute. Okay, so I did, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six pages, which means I have seven more to go. So I, I just did half this book. <laughs> so I'll, I'll have to finish the other half. And I definitely want to put something um, on the cover. I was thinking I could do something like a chocolate uh, cupcake there. And then hold on, where did that... Maybe like, where'd it go? Maybe something like that or something. I'm not sure. I will figure that part out when I get there, but I definitely need to add something on the cover. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and playing in my new little collage book that's now almost done. <laughs> you could totally collage on the back. I just, I don't know. Sometimes it's just fun to just have a little project like this and that's all I needed. All right, everyone, that is gonna conclude today's video. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my video. I really appreciate it. If you wouldn't mind, please give this video a like. It's a great way to support me and get my videos out there so they can be seen in the algorithm. I hope you guys all have a fabulous day and don't forget to drink your water and I will see you guys on Thursday. Just a reminder, tomorrow is Glue Crew Video Wednesday. If you wanna become a Glue Crew member, the link is down in the description box down below. It's a great way to support me and you, every Wednesday you get a video for me that's only for the Glue Crew and I have a playlist of over 60 videos that are just Glue Crew related only. They've never been seen on my channel before. All right, everyone, I'll see you guys on Thursday. Bye.